Right, greener, undead. Well, that's easy Lars for me. Very easy Lars take here. We got Mana Pest and Flambar open. Let's go. I guess no Hellhound. Or, uh, sorry. Hide Hunter. Which isn't too bad. I mean, it's a lot of the time hard to actually get the full Lars effect on that. Oh my gosh, we're starting with a Mana Pest. I may as well lock these two units. The spell isn't so good, but those two units are going to be good support for the mana pest. <clears throat> Got an eight man here. That's good. <clears throat> I don't know too many of these players, though. In fact, I don't know any of them. So we'll see. Let's see what... Uh, Ah, you son of a... Well... Still gonna lock it, I guess it... I don't know. If I can save some health, I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I should have just bought the manifest. This is a wicked strong start, though, all things considered. I don't even care about missing out on the death there. Oh, should have just put two in. Thought I would save myself a health or something. Oh my gosh, this is huge though, to triple this already. Uh, take a speed potion? Sure. Not necessarily like good on tempo right now, but following this, I think we should be. I mean, we're going to get four mana theoretically here. I assume this frickin' mana pest is going to die. I assume. At a 4-3, with it only in the front line. We shall see. I could run this up here. I wonder if that's better. I just really want this thing to die. Yeah, there's a world probably where I... I know, that would have killed every time there. And we don't lose health. Nice. I'll take a second one here for sure. Um, awkward positioning here. <laughs> Shouldn't I just do this? Yeah, let's just do that. <clears throat> Not too shabby, so we're going to get you know our two death effects. It's a great example of, I feel like they should probably nerf Lars down to just one effect. I will say he's probably lackluster at one effect, but not, not really. He'll still be pretty good. He just don't, he'll definitely won't be S tier at just one, but I feel like at two it's still like pretty dang powerful. Probably still the best champ in the game, I don't know. We shall see. I have to think with all this mana I'm getting that it's going to be... Wow. Well, that hurt. So did that, though. Barely lost the manifests, all things considered, even with the scatter shot. Yeah, let's just try to get... Like, I don't need to triple that. Don't need a Nemonot. 
that I want. I suppose since I have both these here, I'll just buy this. If I take this out, it's not like that big of a deal. Of course, it is a 4-1. Gives all of these guys attack. I guess it's better to keep this in. Yeah, this works. <clears throat> okay, we got players frontlining with the <laughs> elementals. I think, uh, we got some newbies here. Treasures. I don't think I take two tangles. So I already got the clan lords and the mana dudes. Let's just make use of them. Definitely want that flambar. All right, who am I selling for this? You? I think so. Sell that. Play down a unit, it's fine. Definitely want the Scholar's Pledge or all of this though. For show. People love casting that shit against me. Alright, we're gonna lose this fight. I'm gonna remember that Frieden Stab 70. Alright, now it is time for us to hard roll for Flambar. There's one. There's two. Uh, now we want them to be doing the stuff. I need a better unit to like have as my carry here though. For now it can be Clan Lord I guess. Hmm. Yeah, let's just keep looking. Okay. Mana Guardian can be it for now, I guess. Big hit. If I don't hit that 50 50, probably might draw there. But we hit it. Alright. Ambush tactics could potentially be pretty good. I didn't really need the speed potion probably in this deck. Um... Come on. You cuck. Whatever. Um, I think I can just do better. It is a ranged unit. It's not necessarily the best one. Are there demons or what? That demon. Oh, I need to buy a unit. Uh, just buy this one for now. Uh, 
I bet the, they must have promoted that Dolish or something. Alright, we lose. But that's because we have a frickin' Void Blade. I mean, it might not have mattered that much. I need a fucking range unit is what I need. Am I gonna just settle for this shit? I don't think that's playing to win. We can... can probably do this, though. I wish you were still ranged. There we go, there's the fucking ranged units. About goddamn time. Don't give a shit about Void Blade. Let's get a... Let's get you going here. Now the worst case scenario is that this dies third, but I'm willing to run that risk because I just don't really think these units slot in good right now. Um, let's go like this, I guess. We want the stats on these fire imps to be certain. Now this mana guardians are right, but eh. it's gonna be a frontliner eventually. And that is why Void Blade sucks. It almost happened. It almost died third. I do miss out still on some scaling by running the mana pest though, but I feel like the two mana per turn is worth right now. But I definitely would like to replace it. And we are losing. Luckily the beefcake pulls it through there. I need to also be on the lookout for ambush tactics. That could help quite a lot. Or the stealth. I hope I didn't roll past it. I probably rolled past it. I often, you know, do that. I think we take this. I think now we can bench, you know, who. Guess we still keep that in the slot one. I need to promote that unit though if I can. Come on, stealth spell. Give up on the stealth, or should I give up on a scholar's pledge? What am I doing? Why is the fucking hell spawn in? I thought I put that on the bench. Ay ay ay. Whatever. And this guy's supposed to be on the left, whatever. I am just fucking up left and right here. How the hell did people allow a goddamn demonster to stay in here at 38 health? Well, we'll put some damage on at least. That's going to be tough to beat though. The, I am a Lars though. I am a Lars. Ooh, ba bomb. We're definitely taking that. Alright, you need to go there. We got our back line here for sure. We need to get that flambar upgraded. Oh, I'll take another Bomb. Do I even want this Arcaros in then? I mean, it definitely does a lot of damage. 15 to be precise. It's more than the Bomb. Ooh. Definitely locking for that. We're one mana short of being able to really do something with it. Could sell the Void Blade, I guess, but eh. No need. So we know the drill with uh, Babam. Scale it up and eventually we'll run Fire Slinger and Mana Guardian in front of it. And that'll be good for finishing the fights out at the end. Hopefully we're able to do so. pretty behind right now.
Yikes, Kraken Hunter. I mean, I may as well replace this guy. It's a minor upgrade, to be certain, but it's worth doing, I think. I guess what I could do is put him up there. I don't know. Maybe not. I mean, I do want these guys to die still. Let's try to get this guy with the more stats, and this guy's big enough. Ooh. One, yeah, I can't sell clean leaf. Well, one, two, three. Damn it. This one got upgraded. I should have just done flying boars. Well, that's awkward. Because uh, we obviously wanted to upgrade the one that had the fucking stats on it. Shouldn't I should have just waited. That was so bad, actually. So, I mean, it almost has... We should just do this, I think. Could go like that, I guess. If it somehow survives, this thing would actually, you know, hit. But yeah, we need to get the stats on the one that's upgraded, unfortunately. I really done fucked up here. I can get rid of this Scholar's Pledge, actually. This, this deck doesn't really use it that much, but obviously the boot camp needs to get out first. I don't think we can have the time for the Hellfire Cannon. We should try to... okay. Do I just promote like this? Or that, maybe? This might be okay to have two of these. Let's... Not bad. Not bad. I'll take it. I'm going to take this, just an easy way to get a 6 cost treasure. And it could be something I stick in front of a bomb. We got a full board now though, so that's pretty good. I guess Mana Guardian at some point could be, get replaced. Well, that sucks that this died fucking after slot 5, but whatever. So much for tanking, that's the Archeros for ya. Should win this fight, as long as we don't... Yeah, there's just no way we could lose it. Told you I'd remember that, Friedenstab. Don't think I forgot. My only regret is I'm not going to be the one that sends you out of here. This motherfucker still hasn't scaled. Ha. <sighs> I don't think we put another one in, though. Like, this one has all the stats. I guess we just buy this. Still. I don't know. Now, now I'm thinking about not doing it, because I'm like, I already got this Mastation and two Krakens. Let's just try to get those. Cell Rat Eruption. Nah. Every roll counts. It's all about that opportunity cost. I do wonder if scaling this Kraken with the better Flambar is a lost cause. What the fuck? <laughs> okay, apparently it's a lost fucking cause. I don't know. At least these guys are scaling. Well, we're wasting the good Flambar half of his fucking proc, so let's just move Fire Slinger back over there. I don't even... I should have just kept the damn Archeros. But, we'll see. So you go the fuck back over there. And... God 
damn, stop. Okay, fuck it. If you're gonna keep doing that shit, just fucking give it to me. I'll just take it so I stop seeing it. Shit. I'm an idiot. I thought one of them was not upgraded, but <laughs> my stupid play here was actually when that happened. Maybe I just wanted to blank it from my memory. <laughs> Eventually, Babam goes left, but I would like it to get maybe just a few more attack. Because, yeah, I think we'll go Fire Slinger, Mana Guardian, Babam there. We can backline with the station as well, maybe. <laughs> I just, this Kraken Hunter is immune to living, I guess. Or allergic to fucking living. We should put the bus station down here because apparently this tank never gets attacked. No, they're definitely running Hellfire Cannon slot one, I would assume. Don't we do that? You know, for this fight, <clears throat> well, we could just do this. I'm fine wasting a Brock here um, to try to get that and put some hurt on the Demonstra, put him on a timer, because we're way, yeah, we, we got it. We got to fucking finish that. It's always damn Lava Golem. I guess we can run Lava Golem and just keep Fire Slinger in the back. That works. Since Kraken Hunter never fucking did anything. Yay, we did it! Oh my god, it almost didn't happen again. Yeah, this is not good. This bitch has been allowed to get a 1-6... Oh my god. What the fuck? Is this thing gonna die? Like, every other goddamn slot but slot 1 is dead now. Good hit. It won that fight, at least. Did we? Not really. If a shot left there, we did. So we don't even put the hurt on them. We're not going to win that. Knowledge Fiend slot one, though. Isn't that good? I think we actually can win. We'll see. Because I'm allergic to getting uh, six costs as well. Or seven. So that's like the first seven I've seen, I feel. Uh, this is okay, I guess. I got large, large, large. It's not really doing much, though. It's not really doing anything, I feel. Sweet mana there. Jesus. Put a lock for it, I guess. It's like, what do I do? Sell my dupes? I guess I could sell the flambar. At least this thing finally has more health than the flambars. That's a good hit. We want to cast that again. I don't know that it does much. Uh, we need to flip this actually. So let's go 
here. Yeah. This works. Could buy this just to dilute it from their pool. We're not going to run the flam bar anymore. Uh, is there any way I could realistically run this unit myself? I mean, it is like okay. I don't think I should you know, just let them have it. They're going to find it anyway. Wraith Queen. That's probably better than the uh, Lava Golem in that slot, so we'll take that. Technically, if this dies before that with the overkill, that could be good. Uh, you're just going to go first every turn and get the best out of three fucking overkills. Okay, whatever. That works. Fucking hell. We're going to get absolutely ravaged here because of that RNG. How can I... Wait, why do I have a station in the front? I'm an idiot. Stop complaining about RNG. And fucking play the game, idiot. Talking to myself here. Okay, we're gonna go... Here. Is there any way I can get that enough attack to actually kill things? Probably not, unfortunately. But it is just a, probably a better unit to use here. We got the pledge, I guess. <laughs> but I need to actually get some sort of treasure. Ooh. Well, fuck me. Um, I don't know, though. Like, that thing with Siege in the back. I mean, it's going to kill a backliner anyway. I guess if that's going to happen, we should just go like this. We actually could go like this, huh? This works. Yeah. Alright, we're geniuses. Let's do that anyway. We're gonna give up on the Lava Golem, I guess. Oh, you went a f Oh, you had the haste. Okay. Well, whatever. Let's fucking go. No pressure on this lobby. Heaven forbid you throw me a bone and slay there. Well, if we can kill that, it would help. Um, snipe, then, could get him. Let's see. I don't think I'm going to be able to get a sun cost treasure. Uh, okay, that will kind of maybe work. Helm of the Abyss? Frosted Axe? Probably Frosted Axe. Get to their back line, maybe. Yeah, here's to hoping. Hoping and a coping. Uh, we are at 6 health. I think we need to sell these and just... Like YOLO here. If I can live the overkill, it was really close there, of the underguardsman, <coughs> then that will help a lot. Whoa, I went first. Amazing. That is really good. Well, we did, would have been better if that got killed too, but I'll take it. Slay, yes. We're winning this one at least. some combat spells, I think. 
Got to get pretty lucky with Wrath here for it to work out for us. Like, it has to hit there or there. If it hits here or here, it even hurts us. I suppose, though, that's okay. I'd rather find something a little more consistent. 46, 56 doesn't change any breakpoint here. Although it would be 4. You know, this dying does eat up my... Uh... Oh, we don't got time, we just have to do this. I was going to say, it does eat up one of my bomb hits, which is not the best. Haste again. Okay, at least... Okay, here we go. Now we're fucking talking. Okay, yep. Sure, hit the best of the three targets, whatever. I think we still win this. Slowly but surely, we're... pulling away here. If I can get one big win... Ooh... Imagine if I could do this... Is that the one I would want to put it on? I think so, because it's... As long as I kill any of them backliners, it, we do want it to die at the same time, though. Hmm. Things doing 102. Maybe we just do this. That works for me. Just get the Mana Guardian some stats, I guess. Why did the overkill hit there? Oh no, it didn't overkill, it was just a bomb okay. Nice. Oh, ho, 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 you're dead, dude. If I can have all three live here. Oh, never mind. But that's one more is all I need. God, we're so close. I can taste it. Could also just do this, and then even if I lose... I live. That's not. It's not how I want to do it. I need it. Finally saw that way too late. Finally saw that way too late. Can I have better spells, please? The fuck. gonna have to do well that could have been good if we draw I guess I got this a weird beast huh I guess they're trying to make my wraith queen not slay of course you know what? I think I still win, though. Like that Hellfire Cannon, yeah, it'll take these out, but guess what? As long as I don't have... Yeah! You may have... I may have lost that 50-50, but I won that 50-50. Causing me to win. Boom, baby. How's that for a comeback? Well, we made mistakes. We remedied mistakes. There were ups, there were downs. It was a 69 well-earned. Anyway, as always, thanks for watching, and until next time, peace.